So I've been looking at leptospirosis in Tanzania. Um, so leptospirosis is a, um, an illness that causes people to be sick with fever, um, but it's a serious kind of an illness. Um, overall, it's killing probably 100,000 people or more uh, each year in sub-Saharan Africa. And um, uh, it looks a lot like malaria to the average doctor or health worker who's, who's looking after people with it. Um, but it also causes other serious side effects, like it can stop the kidneys from working, or it can cause bleeding in the lungs. And so probably about 5 to 10% of people who get sick with it will die. The work that we've mapped out really identifies that it's a major issue, and we've um, got the first steps to identify that livestock are probably a major source for it in Tanzania. So the, the next step really is to, you know, how, what can we do to prevent this? And uh, in New Zealand we've had a lot of success with prevention through vaccination of livestock, particularly dairy cows. It's going to be a lot more challenging in Tanzania because um, in a continent like, like Africa, there's, um, you know, the ecology of the infections is much more complicated. And so getting to that point is going to be a lot harder, but it's certainly you know, it's something that we can keep working on and aim to, to get there. So, you know, one of the best things is, is working with people from different cultures and, and you, know, you feel like you've got, a, you've got a lot of experience and training that, that you can bring to bear, but it's amazing how much you've got to learn in return. And I think, um, uh, you know, I've probably learned much more about about these kind of things working in Tanzania than I, than than they've learned from me. So I, I, yeah, it's hugely satisfying and rewarding kind of work, and it's a great thing to be part of. And it feels really neat to be a, a Kiwi working in something that we can we can contribute in a, in a world sense.